What's up guys, NBA17 here with another video coming at you guys. And um, as you can see, we are in um, a redstone world for some reason. And um, that's because of that box right there. Uh, here, I want to turn off mobs real quick. Peaceful. Um, slash time. Such. Okay. So, um, yeah. Um, today we are actually in a redstone world because I am actually going to be showing off a redstone creation, um, that I've, um, actually seen someone, um, make, and it's completely original, like, um, yeah, it's completely original. Um, I'm not entirely sure if this has actually been on YouTube before, so it might actually not be original, but, um... Still, we are just going to get straight into this. So, as you can see, we have a sign right here that says Casino on it. So, what we are going to do is open this up, and um, this is actually a casino. So, this is good for, um, county servers on Minecraft, or, like, uh, prison servers, or stuff like that, where if you click on a sign, it automatically puts something in your inventory and abducts money from your account. Um... So, in this case, it would take redstone from the chest. So, basically, how it works is um, you go up to the chest, you take out a redstone, and um, there's a chance, there is a 1 and 9 chance that you will get a diamond. Um, so, or it might be a 1 and 8, I, I don't know how to do math. But, um, so, yeah, that is actually a pretty cool... Um, Feature. Yeah, it is one in nine, now that I think about it. So, um, yeah, and today I'm actually going to show you guys how to make it. It is actually a really cool design. And, um, yeah, I think that you guys are going to really like it. So, um, I will see you guys in literally one second. Okay, guys, so basically, um, here is the creation um, without any of that fancy stuff all over it. As you can see, it actually is quite simple. Um... It is a little bit big, um, but overall, I think that it is, um, it's not too big, um, it could, it's pretty compact, and, um, it is a 3 by 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, uh, a 3 by 6, um, build, so it actually isn't too bad at all, so, um, I am actually gonna show you guys how to build it. So basically, what we're going to do is we are just going to build out a 3x6x2, if I'm actually saying that right. Or let me move up. Um, I don't know if I'm actually saying that right, uh, but it's going to be that big. It's going to be two blocks deep, um, three blocks wide, and six blocks long. So that's one, two, three, four, five, and... There we go. We now have six. So one, two, three, four, five, six. So let's just get straight into this. So first, what you want to start by doing is, as you can see over here, we have a dispenser and a dropper right there. So we're going to put the dispenser right there and the dropper right there. Then what you want to do is actually put this chest on top of the dropper. So, um, I forgot to say, the materials that you will need is one redstone torch, um, a building block of your choice, uh, one chest, one redstone comparator, one dropper, one dispenser, and nine redstone dust. Um, that is just my design. Uh, there are probably other designs out there, but, um, that is just my design. If, if I, I'm not really sure if this is original or not, so... Uh, yeah. So then, what we have to do is, I'm just going to lay down some blocks right there. Uh, we need to put down a redstone comparator right here. And um, what we're going to do is actually put any block right here. So basically, what a comparator does is, if you put it by um, a chest, say, in this example, and um, so the comparator senses if there is um, a, an item inside of the chest, and if there is, it sends a redstone signal to, um, to any block. 
So what I'm going to do right here is put up a block right here. So and then put my redstone torch on the back so that the redstone torch turns off. Next, what we're going to do is um, cover this part up like that and put is that how you do it I am not entirely sure yes that is so do that and then down like that no that that's wrong um, as you can see I definitely do not have this design memorized inside of my head um so then you're just gonna want to put a where is I forgot to grab a repeater um and you're going to want to put a repeater right about there and then two redstone dust going forward like this one going to the side going up like that and then to the side no and put this like that i think this is how you do it yep just like that and um for those of you who don't know, how redstone works is um, not only does redstone power the block that it's going into, it also powers the block right next to it. So the efficient thing about this is um, we only have to put this redstone dust going into this um, and it'll power both of these. So that is um, a pretty cool thing that you can do, a little tip. So, um... What we're going to do now is I'm just going to take this out and uh, see all this redstone dust started glowing. But, uh, so let me go into here and uh, I'm going to just put all of this here, take some of that out. And I'll put some of this in here too. So um, you can put anything inside here. Um, yeah. So uh, let's put, say... Uh, one block inside of this dropper so now that is so since this sends a redstone signal to this block the torch is off so what happens is um what you would do is come up to here you would open the chest and take out the red stained hardened clay here let me get rid of this take out the red stained hardened clay wait what hold on let me get rid of all this stuff so you would take out the redstone hardened clay and then it would automatically refill the chest also giving you a um red hardened clay. I keep saying redstone hardened clay. What am what? Um so essentially how this actually works is pretty interesting. So what happens is let's pretend so this dispenser is say your prize machine this dropper replenishes this chest with and with another item so that it never runs out so what happens is since you take this red hardened clay out it automatically turns this off powering this torch which will send a redstone signal all the way over to here which powers these two blocks. Now, since this is powered, it will put another red red hardened clay into the chest, also powering this so that it will dispense your prize. So that's essentially how it works. So let me just take everything out of here, and I'll show you guys um, like this. So what happens is this turns, so since there's nothing in the chest, this turns off for a split second, sending a redstone signal all the way over to here, powering these two for a split second so that it's just enough time to give you your prize and what's in the chest. Pretty cool. So I'll just put that inside there and put all this stuff back into here. And uh, yeah, that is actually essentially it. And uh, you can cover it with all the nice stuff. I like to put it in sort of a booth type thing. And um, what this is good for, again, is like towny servers. It's good um, for making money and stuff like that. Um, it's good for making money because, um, like, I I've seen this before. People literally 
just spam the sign on there and it automatically takes like like a bunch of like it, it would probably be sent for around five hundred dollars on this so you click the sign it puts this redstone this oh my gosh this red hardened clay into your inventory it also abducts money from you and this would go into your inventory whatever's in here which you can put whatever you want in there i have um some stone and diamonds in here so there would be a one in nine chance that you would get a diamond that's what i find the most efficient way is um so yeah it's good for um townie and prison servers and stuff like that when you have access to sign shops or chest shops rather so um yeah guys that is going to be it for this video um i do hope that you all enjoyed and um yeah please do consider like you know, liking commenting and subscribing it always ha helps out a ton and um yeah that is about it for this video um i hope that you all enjoyed and uh yeah peace out